Are you tired of having weak wrists because of the GPD Win Max 2? Well, say no more, friend, because I've got just the solution for you. A GPD Win Max 2 grip. Let's get her done. First, I want to thank We3DPrint for you from Etsy for sending this out. The grip was provided in exchange of a review, but no script nor revision was to be provided, expected, or allowed before me uploading this video to my channel. Therefore, anything said about this product is entirely my own. Instructions. Push one side of the GPD. I like that there's instructions. That's kind of nice. All right, so this is the grip that we have here. Uh, it looks sturdy enough. This is the color I went with, which is forest green. Nice print quality. So you have the little velvet pieces here to rest the Winmax, which I like. I, I like the fact that the bottom here is flat. The way that this installs, I will be able to keep those little legs as well. I don't know if they're going to be useful anymore, but I, I don't need to remove them. So that's kind of uh, nice. Okay. And we don't lose any access. I mean, the reset button, I guess, but... And in the back, we don't either. So we would have the door being blocked. Oops, the door being blocked, I'm sorry. Um, but this and the buttons, we don't lose them. Clip it here. And then once this is well installed, we just clip the other side. This can sit the Winmax to it. sits kind of sloped backwards a little bit. So I could use, technically that works as a stand. It doesn't block ventilations at all. Let's see what happens if I prop the if I prop the legs here. It gives me a bit more height. So this is this is awesome. This can totally work with the kickstands in the back. You don't lose access to your USB C's. Your speakers are out and about. This is this is actually pretty nice. Okay. Now, one thing, at least when holding it upright, I'm really surprised at how I'm able to tuck away my pinky finger beneath and kind of rest it where it's shaved off. And it gives me a little bit of extra support. By default, my fingers went there. This is a more comfortable resting place, but you know, if you don't need to use the stick, so for example, if you're playing a game where you won't need like a uh, emulator kind of game I know for fact that my fingers are gonna rest here whereas if I'm playing something where the analog triggers are essential well you know it's it's just all the same my my comfort position stays the same I mean I like that I'm not losing access to any button if anything the keyboard is not as easy to reach but who cares right this is not um, this is the game so anything gaming, wow, this is surprisingly extremely, I mean, I, I expected that holding the GPD Win Max 2 was going to be more comfortable, but this is night and day. And I kind of have a, a, a different opinion than most in the sense that I find the Win Max 2 to be comfortable for long periods. I'm able to hold it for really long, but this grip really makes me believe that um, I'm gonna be able to do a whole lot more. I like the fact that there is some kind of stops here. So the device is not gonna slide. I mean, it doesn't, it definitely doesn't slide down. Can it slide the other way? I would think so. It could, but because of the Velcro, it's actually holding quite nicely. also holding in that sense it really has a good grip on the console wow this is pretty good closing the gpd win max 2 no issues whatsoever so it has just a little bit of wiggle inside of it so actually let's let's have a look at these buttons i i completely forgot about them originally went out of, let, let me just take it out for a second okay so that comes out nicely I did have some accidental push from the side of the finger. So this is how I would push it. 
one thing for sure is with this hold, I will no longer have accidental push. Yeah, this is a very, very nice grip. So I'm going to play an hour with it and give you my feedback um, on it. So I just came back from playing Minecraft for about an hour with my son. And I mean, I didn't think I was there was room for improvement. So I'm more than willing to, yeah, de you know, accept the form factor when playing with the Winmax 2. But I have to say, this is so much more comfortable. I can never go back. I, I just can't. Uh, so a, a couple of things. One, I ended up trying with these sticks and I'm most likely going to take them off. But because of the way that your grip is kind of widened, so to speak, with these grips, um, for the first time in my life, I feel like I could definitely use these risers. I, I never used those. I don't usually really like them. Um, but it actually works extremely well with the GPD Winmax. So the problem is the cove in which the sticks moves is too narrow. So you lose some movement. It wiggles a little bit. So if I push in the bottom, for example, it kind of, I'm just going to bring it back here. But it has a little bit of wiggle room. So what I'm probably going to do is end up using a little piece of Velcro. Because, you know, I don't want to use double face tape in case I need to remove it for whatever reason. But I feel like with Velcro, it's going to prevent that the thing from moving just a little bit. It's not game breaking. And logically speaking, the way you're usually holding it, it's kind of falling into place. Um, but if ever I, you know, play upside down or something like that. So oftentimes when I play, I'm on my back and I kind of have the thing over my over my face. So I would prefer that it doesn't move at all because it does. I don't know if you guys can hear that. It does move. It does wiggle a little bit and I feel like it could get worse over time. So that's why I'm going to end up using a piece of Velcro. And the very last thing, which is is not a complaint by any mean, it's more of a suggestion. The grip makes it so, you know, when I was saying earlier, I was resting my fingers there. It's really, really comfortable. So I was wondering if ever the designer would be able to make a kind of something that would hold on to the triggers to give a lip to extend. It's extremely comfortable. I, I'm not going to be using the Winmax 2 without it anymore. Um, so I strongly recommend it. We print for you. Thank you. So 10% off. So to sum it all up, here are my pros and cons on the script. The comfort is really amazing, and I must say it improves on every level when holding the GPD Winmax 2. Though it barely happened before, accidental push for LC and RC are just impossible with the grip now. It can effectively be used as a stand, and it completely eliminates any risks of ventilation or any concerns. And last but not least, ports and speakers are, for the most part, unaffected. I say mostly unaffected, which actually ties into the first con. Although ports are indeed visible, there's one USB where it's extremely tight and using it could compromise the case. There's a little bit of a wiggle, which I believe I can address, but you know, it would be preferable if there wasn't. And the concern for longevity specifically around the sticks. I would have hoped that the plastic would protrude a little bit to kind of have a stronger hold but then that could have compromised putting the case in and out. However, I, I feel like um, having a little more plastic would have been better. Now, I'm no 3D printer kind of guy, but if you are, there are three grips that are available on printables.com. Sure reduces the cost if you can print one yourself. They do alter in design. One actually has a kickstand, but they all block the side ports contrary to the one I'm using. Hopefully that was helpful to you guys. Thanks for watching and I'll see y'all on the next one. Peace.